were still at the tournament and um, the baby needed his nap. He was really tired, so I brought him to the car. He's sleeping. Super cute little guy. We were all up late and up really early this morning, but I wanted to um, vlog myself for a minute um, and talk about one of the reasons why I'm doing this. Um, my whole life, probably since I was really young, I've been painfully, painfully shy. And so much so that it has affected my life, I feel like, in a lot of negative ways. Um, prevented me from making friends at certain points. Prevented me from um, doing a lot. I was so shy that um, I can remember a time, Clara's Day, when I was younger. I was probably like 14 Everybody was going around a room, they were supposed to introduce themselves, and they got to me, and I just sat there, frozen, and I never got up. I never introduced myself. They ended up just moving on. That has pretty much been the story of my life for all my life. Um, too quiet and too shy to um, do anything, and I'm tired of it. It still affects me as an adult. And I see some of my kids having some of the same um, problems with being too shy. And I don't want that for them because I hated it. I actually can sing. And I love to sing. And um, I wouldn't say it was like the best, but I enjoyed it. But because I was so shy, I never, ever used that talent. And um, I feel like it was a waste it's disappointing. It's really disappointing. I can't publicly speak. And uh, even actually over Christmas, we went over to my husband's family. And there was a big crowd there. And everybody was going around the room telling what their favorite Christmas tradition was. And sure enough, it got to me. And I went and hid in a corner like a little kid. And that's embarrassing. <laughs> it really is embarrassing. Um... I think it's just as embarrassing to not say anything as it is to say something, but yet I don't say anything and I don't understand why. Long story short, I am doing this to help get over all of that. I don't know if it's going to help. I don't know if it's only going to make it worse, but um, even doing this is weird. <laughs> I'm looking around saying, who's looking at me? <laughs> So, my goal would be to get better at it, and also to start vlogging in public with people around. I can't imagine any other way to get over um, stage fright <laughs> than holding a camera on your face in public <laughs> and talking to it. Um, we'll see. And I don't know if any of you out there have the same problem and um, can relate, but I just... I felt like I needed to talk about it. I felt like um, there's got to be more people. It can't just be me. And maybe we can all get over this together. Um, I don't know. It's definitely difficult. And I am not sure, you know, it's what's, f this is for me. Um, but we'll see, I guess. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Um, all right. Okay, so if I'm going to get over this fear, I'm going to need your guys' help and your guys' support. Um, there's no support like encouragement and um, knowing that there's people counting on you to um, do it so that they can do it themselves. So... I need your guys' support and your help. If you guys could, um, yeah, she was watching me. <laughs> ah! um, <laughs> if you guys could support me and help me by subscribing, by giving me your words of encouragement, or telling me what I'm doing wrong, <laughs> or um, telling your friends. Either way, just support would really help. And, um... I, sub 
I appreciate the support that we have now, and even though it's very small, and that's good, that's okay. Like I never even expected um, to have any subscribers, let alone the whole total of uh, 20 that we have. <laughs> um, anyways. Um, I want to do this. I want to get over this fear. I want to get over, um, being shy and letting it control and consume my life. And I definitely don't want my kids to suffer with it too and to let it control them and look back with so much regret because they couldn't just get over it and just, and just do it. Um, thanks.